So I got the gear. So there's the hole. There's some really cool steps back over there. And there's a lot of low end um, rock formations. See that straight line there? There's a lot of outbuildings over here. There's a lot of land here. But uh, I really, uh, if I get sleepy, I guess I can sit on that. Check out this. Yeah, this thing's so badass. I told my kids if they're bad, they're going down in here. The well, right on a stone wall. Pretty neat, huh, guys? Looks like a skitter went, drove right over that. But no, there's a lot of stuff here. So, um, all right, I'm gonna get digging. Enough talking. So, um, yeah, using the uh, Vanquish 340. If you know that sound, it's Mine Lab. Uh, for under 200 bucks, the depth is incredible. You can smash saltwater beaches with no falsing. <clears throat> this um model is the entry level in the Van Crush series, and it doesn't have a pinpoint button. But you can toe, toe and heel, toe heel, toe heel to figure out like where you're digging. So that's what I'm using. All right, so I, I guess I consider myself like where the hearth of the chimney would be. But it's really shallow because there's a lot of rocks here, but. Super high tone. And it's showing like not very deep. So um, let me see here. Of course, that's how it works out. The freaking ground is frozen right here. Pretty, pretty solid. I got a cheesy pinpointer. I'm not a big fan of it. I'm making tons of noise, probably with the camera, but let's see if this thing just can pick up anything. No. All right, so I'm gonna chip away. Shit, guys, I found it. Oh, fuck. This is so frozen. Just to show you how frozen this is, I'm gonna stay with, but like, yeah, 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 I can dig the dirt, but I see an edge. I see round. See it? Right there. It's so frozen in there. Something round right there. And my cheesy pinpointer. <laughs> you can see the round there. Fuck. All right. Um, give me one second. I didn't like doing that, but I had to shovel it. I broke it up. I broke it loose. It's a coin. Or a button. Feels too thick to be a button. <laughs> Looking right. I don't know. We'll find out. Dude, that guys, I have not gone around forever. Look at, I mean, you see... I'm like right on the edge here. I'm ready to fall in with that door. Yeah. Seems fairly thick, too. Ah, yes. All right, so um, I moved away from um, the edge of the, the hole right there because the ground is way too frozen. Clearly here, it's... um. Not frozen, but there's freaking bricks everywhere. But I got a nice high-end tone right here. You can hear the iron everywhere else. But right there, and if I lift it, we're not getting much. So it sounds like it could be a good target with some iron. Um, I'm just going to dig it and... See if we can pop something out. Um, well, this could be a tip or not. I don't know. Um, so you see the road. You can see the embankment right here where it's been eating away all the way down. 
It's kind of like your fresher edge. Boy, is it noisy. There's stuff everywhere. But um, at parks and old homesteads and at even houses where you can see like where they... Right here, I'm getting a really high... Right there. Not up high. It's not showing deep either. It might be because it's it's wearing away from the edge. So let's see what it is. Ah, oh, shit. I did something I should have. Shouldn't have done. So I took this plug out because I was getting a hot signal and I want to move some of the leaves because I'm on the bank. And I'm getting this big signal. And I saw it and I pulled it out and then I quick just... Look at this guys i thought it was a piece of glass and i don't know why i went after it because i saw the thin part of it what the fuck is that thing that is cool so um, i'm gonna set that right there for a moment i'm just curious if that was i don't know if i'm picking up the shovel so let me move this oh speaking of things right <laughs> Right when I came over here, look look what else I freaking found. You guys would be like, why are you touching that? Definitely a freaking leg or femur to some sort of animal. But look at it, it looked like it was sawed off. So somebody went out deer shooting, killed the deer, and then dumped the stuff out in the woods for the coyotes to eat. But that that looks sawed. Um, sawed. Fucking A. And I'm touching it. Whatever. So, we got this. Right out of the hole and there's some more. I mean, this whole bank is busy sounding. Yeah, I don't really, but you can hear all the. I mean, there's just signals everywhere. So I'm gonna run this bank up to the, the rhino and then I'm done. Hey, surprising it's on Memorial. Don't mind my thumb crack. <laughs> Jeez, I'm crow. That shit hurts. It's a, uh, well, it's upside down, but yeah, no, it's a uh, Indian. Cool. I just saw a stinking, right, right there, right in that corner. Really high tone, hitting 18. I mean, darn it, guys. I could just dig this whole thing right here, this whole lip, because the cellar hole's about 20 feet. We see where it flattens out. That's where the hole is, but. Seems like this is a good part because it's the old road. If you're hanging out in front of your house, you're sitting right here. You know what? I'm going to do a little bit more than I'm going to call it. So guys, if you watch this video this far, that's cool. So I'm pretty much done. Um, got the detector, shovels, everything loaded in the back. Um, yeah, it's been a while since I've been out, so really cool. Uh, other than that, seems like we're going to have really warm weather next week. I think we're going to be able to dig into February. <laughs>